We are the proud winners of the Great British High Street Awards 2018. We felt that we, were, we had a fantastic story to tell. Not only do we have a brilliant independent high street, we've got a community that has put their own hands in their own pockets to protect that. That led to the Great British High Street initiative. We engaged the people and, and, and we've managed to win it. The Great British High Street Award has definitely benefited our business. We've seen more people come in talking to us about it and asking how does it feel to be based on the best high street in the UK, which is really nice. We get lots of people who live here as well who I think are really proud of the fact that their high street's been recognised and the amazing work they've done as a community has kind of been recognised on a national level. The publicity has been great for, for the town, bringing new visitors to see the Great British High Street and what it has to offer. That extra footfall, that extra money that's coming into town has the benefit of securing jobs and securing our high street. As a direct result of winning the Great British High Street campaign, a National Sunday newspaper said that we were the best place to live in Wales. Now you cannot buy publicity like that. I know there's a lot of enthusiasm about the visa spend and win competition in Crickhow and we had a lot of winners and that benefited not only the customers and, and, and the community but also the businesses. It's so important. The sense of community in the town is really built on the high street I think so we see it every day where people will come into the shop they'll bump into friends or neighbours they haven't seen for a while and um, it gives them a chance to catch up they might arrange to go for coffee and that sort of thing you wouldn't get if you don't have a high street that's thriving. Local community have always been pleased to have a shop like ours and we've always supported the local community back. Uh, it's a two-way street as far as that goes. The community is fantastic in Krakow. It all always pulls together and we have a lot of support both ways. We developed the walking festival and the open studios event and those are sort of at different times of the year to encourage visitors to come to Krakow at times where otherwise the high street and the town might have been quite quiet. All the shopkeepers, they know each other by name. The shopkeepers know their customers by name. They do whatever they can to help them. We're rural, so we do have um, a lot of elderly people. Um, there's been a lot in the press about loneliness, and we try and make sure that everybody's looked after. They would get their prescriptions, they would deliver their purchases. We have regular customers, we know their names, we know their dog's names, we know when to collect their pension, if they're ill. Um, I know there are shopkeepers that run and get food for them. The key differentiating factor is the passion and that's a word that I, I, I have used a lot. I think everyone understands the importance of a unique independent high street and, and, and what impact that has on a community. The building we are in is community owned, so it was part of a pub that was bought by over 250 members of the community. They raised nearly three quarters of a million pounds to purchase it, renovate it into three independent shops. So just before the judges came, uh, we organised a, a volunteer cleanup, And we had an amazing response. We had about 200 people turn up from different groups to litter pick, to weed, wash windows on the storefronts. And it gave people a sense of ownership over the awards as well. So they felt that they'd done their bit to help their town. I've never seen so many high-vis jackets buying beer over the bar at the beer. <laughs> I took photographs of our traders you know, holding up the GBHS Crick Howell hashtags. The local baker iced it into a cake. The Natural Way laid it out in coffee beans. The, the Cubs and the Scouts made banners and bunting so we could decorate, decorate the high street when the judges came. Many of the shopkeepers donated teas, coffees, cakes. We had little Great British High Street cupcakes for the day. Winning means that we can implement things like appointing a business ambassador and putting digital signage and mapping in place for visitors to the town. We won £15,000 as the main prize. The benefit as far as our shop's concerned is that it's increased footfall and I think it's put the town more on the map than it has ever been before. It's a great sense of pride that the High Street won this award because it feels like everybody has. We've got a population of about 2,000 people. We had well in excess of 2,500 votes on social media. You can get a sense of belonging and family and community from just walking down, down the high street. I've been here now just 12 years and believe me, I would never move from here now. It's never a dull moment and we've got a fantastic relationship with both our fellow traders and all our lovely customers that come in to see us. It's just wonderful to be on the high street but also feel like you're part of a family. I've lived here all my life and Crick Howell is in my blood, community and high street.